ultimately we hope that this project will bring a lot of folks together to think in a big way about what we have here. This is the Saratoga foothills to the Adirondacks, and it connects our downtown area all the way to the wilderness of the Adirondacks. So that involves many communities, many landowners, a lot of people who are interested in the resource but may not know that much about it. And it's gonna take some time to educate everybody. The Palmertown Range actually extends beyond Saratoga County. It starts in Saratoga Springs, um, and then it runs up all the way to Fort Ticonderoga at the base of Lake Champlain. So it's a sort of southern Adirondack foothill. And there's Moreau Lake State Park, and there's McGregor Correctional Facility, and then there's some private land, and then there's Lincoln Mountain State Forest, and Daniels uh, Road State Forest, and Skidmore College, and you're in Saratoga Springs. It is the birthplace of the Hudson Valley. And so the Hudson River comes out of the high peaks of the Adirondacks and it flows south, but once it leaves the eastern edge of that ridge of the Palmertown Range, it leaves the mountains for the last time. As more research has been done to identify key habitat corridors and really important conservation areas, the Palmertown Range has popped as being really critically important, both for habitat conservation and also for wildlife flow. The opportunities of the Palmerton Ridge Trail are, are multi-use uh, and, and multi-objective. But first and foremost, it's the ability to live here and be able to get on your trail right from your home, right from your office, uh, and connect to the biggest state parks in the area and create economic opportunities along the way. And again, that's where the Palmertown Range comes in. You're talking about a tremendous opportunity to link trails that are in disparate communities right now, not just in Saratoga County, but beyond into the Adirondacks, to the south, into Albany and the Capital Region. And it could all take place as a result of that one particular project. And by having additional recreational opportunities, you know, that's going to draw people into our community. To have a healthy economy, a sustainable economy, you have to have economic growth, but you also have to have a quality of life that helps to attract talent and people. And one of the draws for the prospective employees of those businesses will be the recreational opportunities that uh, we have here in place. If we're gonna have spaces and places in 50 or 100 years uh, that people are gonna be able to enjoy, um, then we ought to get started in protecting those places uh, because we're losing acres and acres a day. But as sprawl continues to grow here and as that Northway Corridor continues to grow and as Saratoga County continues to be one of the fastest developing in New York State, now the things that were um, seemed to be impractical in the past are not as impractical. So we are starting to see a lot of um, sprawl development in the hillsides up into the Palmertown Range. Well, we all know water is a precious resource. You turn on the faucet, you don't always think about where your water comes from. As it turns out, the Palmertown Range is the water supply for thousands of people. Moreau, Corinth, Wilton, Greenfield, Saratoga, all of them get their drinking water from water that comes from the Palmertown Range region. If you look at communities that have done a really good job of conserving their watersheds, that pays back huge dividends to them in clean drinking water and not having to build really expensive facilities to, to process that water before you drink it. Uh, our forests are the natural Brita filter, right? And the Palmer Town is doing that. I mean, the Palmer Town Range uh, project is really uh, just a, a huge opportunity for uh, Saratoga County, for all the communities um, along that area uh, and beyond. More people that do get to see it will realize that 
uh, not only is this worth protecting, but there are opportunities that, uh, for local businesses that go along with that conservation effort. I mean, not only the business opportunities that could come from this kind of recreational development, but the quality of life translates into economic value. That made it a very high priority for Saratoga Plan, and it already had been a very high priority for OSI. So at that point, we sort of got together and said, well, maybe we should be working in partnership and maybe we should be doing some planning to identify what the conservation in this region should look like and what recreation should look like, and also economic development and where there is opportunity for growth and development that's compatible in this area. What I learned is that right here in Saratoga County, we have an incredible set of resources. And most people would drive right past this area to go to the Adirondacks. They didn't realize that they had this great resource right in their backyard. What does it mean to live here and to live in this place? And it, it means living in the woods. And that's why people come here. They come here to be part of that.